Hussein al Sheikh says his father died after a chest infection that quickly worsened into kidney failure. Soon after, other family members fell ill too. Doctors now believe it was the new deadly coronavirus. When the first time they told me I have corona, the first things I thought about is I'm going to die because I thought about my dad and I said it's going to be the same case and I'm going to lose my life. This is NCOV and the World Health Organization is monitoring it closely, especially now that human to human transmission has been verified between patients and from a patient to healthcare workers. Doctors from the WHO are in Saudi Arabia to monitor the spread of the virus. Of most concern, however, is the fact that the different clusters seen in multiple countries increasingly support the hypothesis that when there is close contact, this novel coronavirus can transmit from person to person. Now, according to the Centers for Disease Control, this is where the virus was first detected in April 2012, Saudi Arabia. Then it spread to other countries in the Middle East, including Qatar and Jordan. Now, by February of this year, travelers to the Middle East had brought the virus to Europe, France, Germany and the UK, all reported mostly isolated cases. Now, there have been at least 40 confirmed cases and 20 of those patients have died. The largest cluster is in Saudi Arabia. Doctors say anyone with sustained daily close contact with an infected person is at risk of contracting the virus. There is no evidence yet that it can be passed on through casual contact, but health authorities are keeping a close watch for any indication that it could spread more quickly. Atika Schubert, CNN, London.